Hi members, hope you can hear me. I'm just doing a two minute video on showing you that you can safely sublimate on these beautiful baby comforters. I am, um, as you are aware, they are velvet or plush fleece. They're all 100% polyester. So you, very, you need very much light pressure for these. Just a little tiny pre-press, that is all. Because you've got to remember, the harder you press these, the flatter they will go. But it's not the end of the world if they do flatten. Because you can bring the pile back up with your lint roller and <clears throat> a few other tips or whatever. So I'm just going to put a little detail on this because it's um, for little blue boy and it says Nanny's little cuddle pud. So um, obviously you can't get the elephant or the toy in the press. So I'm just going to lay that over in the corner. I'm going to get it in as far as I can. So you've got quite a good area that you can press on. Okay. Remember your blowout paper. Very light pressure. I've got it on 190 for 60 seconds. <clears throat> and then we'll bring the pile back up using my lovely little lint roller that you can get from the pound shop. Um, eBay, Amazon, whatever you want. And I might have a bit of trouble with mine today because it's stuck down and, oh, no, I've done it. Pull off the new layer. So we've got a nice sticky lint roller. So you can see that. I'll take that out. Once we've done this, we're going to be pressing a binky because um, I've come up with another little idea that might help you market some things while you're on lockdown. So, there we go. This is gonna be flat. Please don't worry about it. The transfer's pinged off already. But as you can see, the colors come out beautifully. So, and actually, they don't flatten as much as you think. So, I'm just gonna show you the results on that quickly because I've got a couple of other things I wanna do. Look at that. There you go. Nanny's little cuddle pud. You can put what you want on these, but you must wash them. Um, I use Subliger inks, which are safe for clothing, um, and they don't run or resist, but I'm really not sure about all the other inks and things you could buy. I'm not an expert on that, but it's for a baby. Um, usually these are kept for decoration, but... You know, if a baby's going to have that in its mouth, you've got to make sure that that's colour fast and everything else. So Subliget inks are 100% safe, but you will wash this before you give it away. And if you don't want to wash the head, you just wash, you hold that out and wash that with soapy um, bubbles, your detergent or whatever, and to dry. But as you can see now, there's hardly anything on there at all. Okay, right, <clears throat> that's that one. 